We are back in Las Vegas 2022 after three long years. Innovation continues to drive the future of our industry at an accelerated pace. Fast, furious, and constant, we have everything you could possibly imagine right here at NAV. Ashley within broadcast. Joining me is John Hickey of Black Box. Hello. Hello. Hi. Nice, Ashley. Good to see you. So. You have a couple new things here at the show currently. Can you tell me about those? So yes, we're launching a couple of new products here at the show. Um, it's all about our Emerald, our high-performance KVM over IP system that is designed to seamlessly operate over physical uh, computers as well as virtual machines. And what we're actually launching here is uh, one product is our uh, Emerald GE, our gateway product, that allows you to connect to virtual machines and be able to share them across multiple users. So. Typically, virtual machines only allow one user per time to actually access them. With the Gateway product, we allow that to be shared across multiple users. And also, the Gateway product allows us to access those virtual machines using, uh, say, Microsoft RDP or the Teradici PC over RP, PC over RP Ultra protocols, which again is increasingly important in the broadcast industry. A second new product we're launching here is our Emerald View product, which is a multi-viewer for UHD streams in and actually share them across any of up to two UHD monitors in any kind of format you like, uh, freeform uh, fixed layouts and things like that. And the third thing we're actually showing is just our software enhancements that are, we haven't been at the show for two years because of various COVID reasons. So we're showing a lot of the software enhancements we've added to the uh, Emerald product line in terms of our remote app experience where you can use a software receiver as a way of connecting to KVM systems or our uh, management platform, which makes it very much easier to debug a system at a system level as, against, as a device manager. And then also showing that full interoperability so that you can connect to a H on a HD receiver, you can connect to 4K sources without actually uh, affecting the 4K stream. So you can have a, a pixel perfect uh, experience on a 4K receiver and you can have a visually lossless one on a HD receiver because obviously the HD receivers need a, a lower bandwidth. They can't take a completely lossless stream into them. Sure, and now you mentioned COVID. How has Black Box adapted during the pandemic to fit your customers' needs? So we would have seen a lot of customers moving, obviously like uh, most of the industry where people wanted to work remotely. And we worked a lot with broadcasters to enable them to say, particularly say in OB trucks, where they, for social distancing re reasons, could only say have 15 people in a truck where pre previously they might have 80 to 100. So what we had is technology allow them to have those people back, say, in California while they're accessing something in Charlotte or in New York for an, an outside broadcast and controlling the equipment in the truck as if they were physically in there, whether it's like a replay machine or other things like that, using our system. Because the Emerald system has very low network bandwidth, so they're able to go over wide area networks. Also, then we allowed multiple people to kind of access their physical assets inside a building from their homes in various formats, you know, uh, using kind of the Emerald technology. That was a large part of, of, of the actual, I suppose, the last two years as people kind of scrambled to kind of work from remote locations as against being physically in the office. And can you tell us what we can expect from Black Box in the near future? So what we're, we're calling following on those trends where we're going to support um, more of that kind of remote working, remote access. Uh, and also one of the trends we're kind of very much focused on from a development point of view is making the systems more transparent to users. So one of the things we're hearing back from a lot of our customers is they need their operators to do, you know, their span of control needs to increase. In other words, they need the operators to do more work because they have less people because, it, you know, it's harder to hire people. So what we're trying to do is make the systems easier to use, hide the technology from the user, so that no matter what they're doing, it's very easy to, to learn the system. They're not learning complicated shortcut commands and things like that. So we're investigating a lot of technology to kind of do that, um, to make that kind of uh, usability of the system much easier. So for people that want to know more, I know we can't get into everything that's going on right now, but uh, your website for yeah, so you can find more on uh, our website, uh, blackbox.com, um, and in, uh, you can go to the KVM page and the Emerald page and find all the details of what we're talking about here. Very nice. Thank you so much for speaking with us today. Thank you very much.